with a 10-0 start and the only undefeated team remaining in the Big Ten. The IU women's basketball team is clearly buying into the idea that every win is a win for the team and not individuals. My teammates have my back. They kind of saw me out there struggling, but they were all surround, surrounding me like, Sasha, you can do, you can do, keep fighting, you know, we got your back. And that's what it's all about. It's not just about me, it's about this team, and that's what we're focused on this year. We're winning as a team, not as individuals this year. We want to keep that going for the rest of the season. I just try to go out there and do what I can to help the team win, whether that's play really hard on defense and try to get steals or um, <coughs> score when I can, I guess. So I'm just trying to be a part of the team. It was really big for us. <clears throat> I mean, it was a team win tonight, so it wasn't really all about that play, but that was definitely where it kind of changed. Uh, that With the victory over Milwaukee, the IU women's basketball team moved to 10-0 and for the first time since 1994-1995. This is also the first 10-game win streak for the program since that year as well. It's a great experience, you know, just being a part of the new era and having something actually start the build here at Indiana for Indiana women's basketball. It's been a long time coming, and I, I think we're finally on the move up. Playing for each other will be particularly important as this team faces a tough road stretch and plays the most road games in the Big Ten. From Assembly Hall, I'm Josie Janovicius, IU Sportcom.